All right, you saw the title. In this video, I'm gonna be comparing two of my videos that have similar view counts, except one is a YouTube short and one is just a standard YouTube video. And I'm gonna tell you exactly how much YouTube paid me from a YouTube short and a standard YouTube video that both have around 400,000 views. So this video is gonna be really quick. I'm just gonna get straight to the point. I don't wanna waste your time, but please consider subscribing and liking this video. I would really, really appreciate it and it'd help my channel out a lot. Without further ado, let's hop on the computer and check it out. So the first video we're talking about is this YouTube short right here. Now this is on my main channel, which is linked down in the description. This is actually my second channel that you're watching right now if this is your first time seeing me. Either way, this is a 21 second long YouTube short and it has almost 405,000 views. So it's performed very well. This is my number one performing YouTube short um, by a long shot. I mean, this one went pretty viral and I'm really proud of it and really thankful that that happened. However, um, by looking at the revenue, it's definitely a surprise for me. I mean, this is my first viral-ish YouTube short um, that I've made. And just seeing the difference that I get paid for a standard YouTube video versus YouTube short was pretty surprising to me personally. So I'm gonna reveal it in just a second, but as you can see, this also got 2.3 thousand hours of watch time and it's gained me 890 subscribers. I mean, almost a thousand people that will hopefully stick around and become fans of my channel is amazing. And then you can even just see this view graph. I uploaded this on, let's see what it'd be, October 27th. And it was, you know, getting a lot of views, 18,000, 20,000 views. That's pretty good for, you know, what I figured a YouTube short would get. 30,000, 40,000, 50,000, 60,000, 70,000. It starts to pick up 80,000. Then as soon as it breaks, 100,000 views right there. Um, let's see, what would that be? October 21st, as soon as it hits 100,000 views, it just suddenly takes off right there all the way to 405,000-ish views. So with that, 404.8 thousand views, this has made me 86 cents. 86 cents from 400,000 views. <laughs> Definitely stick around to see how much my other video made me because 86 cents is pretty much a drop in the bucket compared to what, you know, a normal video made me. However, I don't want to say, like, that's just 100% a bad thing. Like, oh, that's terrible, they should pay more. Um, because there's a lot more things that go into it. Of course, it's a 20 second video. So people are watching it for less time. There's gonna be less time for multiple ads to play, if any ads. It also took probably a percentage of the amount of time to create uh, for me in terms of like, you know, working hours or minutes or however long it took to make versus a real video. So in a way, take this as a grain of salt, um, but in a way, it's almost like a YouTube short would be working an entry level job. You're not putting in maybe as many hours. You know, you're not using um, as much of built up skills from, you know, going to college and sort of thing. It's almost like an entry level job. Whereas a longer YouTube video that, you know, could be anywhere from five to 30 minutes long that you might put in multiple, multiple, multiple times the amount of money, energy, effort, time, everything into it. And I think of that as more of like a career, like you built up a career, you're obviously gonna get paid more than an entry level job. And that's just, that's kind of the way I see it. Now, of course, there are definitely a lot of YouTube shorts that took a hundred times the amount of time, effort, and money than a video that's, you know, a half hour long. There's definitely different proportions and everything. However, that's just kind of the way I personally think of it. It makes sense to me because I spent way less time creating this YouTube short than I did creating the video that we're going to talk about. But either way, now that I'm done with the rant, let's get into the next video. All right, so this one right here has gotten 448,000 views. So about 40,000 more views than the other video. So it's not a direct, direct comparison, but this is pretty much the closest comparison that I could find on my channel in terms of videos with similar views. So 448,000 views, you can see this has actually been a pretty smooth graph here. It's just pretty much consistently gotten views. Um, now the thing about this one is I uploaded it January, January 16th, 2020 two and a half years, almost three years ago. So this is a much older video than the other one, which is only a few months old. So it's taken a lot more time to generate a similar amount of views, you know, three years versus three months or so. But then you can see right here, it's gotten 48,000 hours of watch time. So this goes back to what I was just talking about. Um, this is a 20 minute and 43 second video. So there's a lot more time throughout the video for YouTube to run ads in between, in the beginning, at the end, you know, all throughout the video essentially because it's just a longer video and people are there watching it for a lot longer amount of time. And also this is giving me 5.4 thousand subscribers. 
The other one was under a thousand subscribers, so this is also gaining me a way, way, way greater amount of subscribers. And then last but not least, this is the part you've been waiting for, how much money I made from 448,000 views in about two and a half years. And this is it right here, $4,614.20. So, a similar amount of views, you know, between 400 and 450,000 views. On one video, I made 86 cents. On the other one, I made $4,614. That spread between how much I got paid for two similar viewed videos is crazy. But again, it, it somewhat makes sense. I know YouTube's also adding changes at the beginning of the year that will pay a lot more for YouTube Shorts, which I'm really looking forward to. I don't post a lot of YouTube Shorts. But just based off this one getting 400,000 views in just a few months, I'm definitely going to keep up with it and continue to post more shorts in the future. But I do think for a channel like mine, where I typically make longer form content, shorts are mostly just used as a way to bring in new subscribers and just expand my reach to reach people that may have never found out about my channel unless I did post a YouTube short. It's definitely not, for me personally, um, you know, a way that I want to be a main income source or a way that I want to make a lot of money through. I see it as just a way to really, really expand my reach as a YouTuber. But either way, that is it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. Please consider going down, hitting the like button and subscribing to this channel. And I will see you in the next one.